time. All right, so I want us to now go back to um, the Mili Money, AIC Mili Money. I understand that the widow of the late Nicholas B. Watt is currently speaking. Let's just cross over there and listen in. From his kindness, most of all me, my grandchildren, we have benefited from his wisdom. And everybody who came across him will tell you from his moral support. I am thanking God for the privilege of having been his wife. I am now the mother, the grandmother, the great-grandmother of his offspring. And look what is standing behind me. Look how proud I am of them. I hope I shall always merit this honor. Thank you. Thank you very much, Annie. Thank you very much, uh, Mrs. Annie Biwot. Now I'll call upon uh, the children of uh, late Honorable uh, Biwot to come forward and read their tributes. Please come forward. Dear Dad, thank you for giving me your mother's name. Thank you for the lunch dates, the love, the mentorship, and most importantly, thank you for the time. Thank you for all the lovely memories. You were always my favorite hello, and now my heart is goodbye. Dad would walk into the office to find me working on my computer, and he would say, your computer ako imekwambia nini leo. He never understood why today's generation relied so much on on computers. He was always practical, tagged me along to uh, events where when he went so that I could learn by watching him doing what he was doing. I enjoyed how he taught me how to do things all the time and how he would listen to Oh, at the times when he would not uh, know something, he would tell me to listen to somebody who he thought was the best. Um, and when I wasn't receptive to his ideas or when I thought I knew better, he would always tell me, Fuata Yangu, which he would explain uh, by telling me that he's only telling me this because uh, he cares. As you can all tell, this is very difficult. Um, um, for me, um, I had great times with him growing up. Uh, one specific incident I remember um, when, was when I was anxious about 
launching uh, a project that I'd been working very hard on. Um, as usual, I'd talk to him about what's going on in my life. With this particular one, I remember him saying, Clara, this is your time to shine. Don't let anything or anyone steal your glory. We all know he had a way with words. Like magic, he would calm you down, venerate your spirit and confidence, all the while remembering, reminding you to believe in yourself. Um, and this is really because he actually believed in us more than anything. He didn't have faith and he had it for you. So with that, I'll just say I'll, I'll miss you, Daddy, beyond words. in a few minutes. So like I mentioned, that is the requiemus of uh, Nicholas B. We also understand that uh, former Tanzanian President Jakaya Kikwete is present. Uh, also the NASA leader, Rail Odinga, is also present among other dignitaries there and we'll be, getting, we'll be going back there shortly. All right, for now, so we want